In 1988, Gabi Tokalski, having risen to master diamond cutter, was requested by Harry Oppenheimer, head of De Beers, to evaluate a 599 carat rough diamond. I entered his office and was presented with a box. From that moment, I had changed. All I could think about was the diamond. This remarkable rough stone, valued at the time for $100 million, was to become known as the Centenary Diamond. It took three years to create, to make tools, to plan, to cut, to polish, to create the perfect symmetry. What did the diamond want to become? I cut the stone in Johannesburg, South Africa, which is where it had been originally discovered. I assembled a key team to assist me, including my son, Jean-Paul Tolkovsky. In 1991, the task was complete. In a private audience with Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, Gabby presented the 273.85 carat finished stone. Cut to a modified heart shape, the stone had 247 facets, 164 on the crown, and 83 around its pavilion. To this day, the centenary remains the world's largest modern cut D flawless diamond.